and gentlemen, this info has literally just dropped as I click out of all these ads on YJ Organization. What's going on, you guys? He or, wow, I really screwed that up. Ladies and gentlemen, it's your host with the most Avery LR32 here. Kind of threw myself off there for a minute. But we got some new Drytron support revealed. Why stop at 4,000 attack when you can go to 5,000? It was actually ready for duel that revealed these. No translations, of course. And then YGO Organization just posted their article. So destroy the other little boo-boo stain off that like and subscribe button as we see if we can drag Drytron back on up to tier one. So I haven't read these cards yet. Uh, I do know about the Fiend Smith cards. Those cards are really busted. Um, I didn't really want to make a video on them because I didn't know if they were going to be all that good. So I didn't really want to waste your time or mine, but more importantly, yours. Anyway, I'm going to shut up now. Uh, level one light machine, special summon effect monster. This is Drytron New 2, NU2. This is some Mewtwo shit. <laughs> 2000 attack, zero defense. Cannot be normal summon or set. Must be special summoned by a card effect. Okay. You can only use the uh, first and second effect of this card's name each once per turn. You cannot ritual summon monsters that turn you activate either of this card's effects except machine monsters. The special summon by a card effect thing and only being able to summon machines is fine. Uh, if there is a Drytron card on the field, okay, you could special summon this card from your hand to graveyard, but vanish when it leaves the field. Damn. If this card is special summoned, you can have one Drytron monster from your deck to your hand except new two. This card is actually really good. This card is named after V2 Draconius, a binary, blah, 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 blah. So this is the new 5,000 attack and defense monster, Drytron Medionis December Alpha Draconoids. Jesus Christ. Level 12 Light Machine Ritual Effect Monster, 5,000 attack and defense. If you're not winning after dropping this card on the board, I don't know what you're doing. You can ritual summon this card with Medionis Drytron. Other Drytron monsters you control cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects. That seems pretty good. Up to twice per turn when your opponent activates a monster effect, quick effect, you can banish Drytron monsters from your graveyard whose total attack equal or exceed that monster's original attack, negate the activation, and if you do, destroy that monster. Huh. So you have a double monster negate. Specifically negates activation. So if it says you can only use this effect and you still stop them, but if it says you can only activate this effect once per turn... If you're negating the activation, they can just do it again. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh, well, it destroys the monster anyway. What am I saying? I'm sorry. Never mind. I'll shut up now. If this ritual summon card you control is destroyed by your opponent, you can special summon one ritual monster with 4,000 attack from your hand or deck. This is treated as a ritual summon. Jesus! I mean, how are they even going to pop this thing? Like, uh, well, other dry Drytron monsters, but like... If, you're, if you have this on the board, you sure to be winning. They already have a combo that skips the opponent's main phase. So, like, if you can do that and get this out, I feel like you've just won. Uh, this card is named after Dad. The code terminology for December Alpha Draconoids, Meteor Showers, is discovered, blah, 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 blah. Uh, and then the last one here we have is Medio Aurora Drytron, Continuous Trap. You can only use the first and second effect of this card's name each once per turn. If a Drytron card or cards becomes Banished, you contribute one Drytron monster, then target up to two of your banished Drytron cards, add them to your hand. This card seems fucking bananas. You can reveal one Medionis Drytron in your hand, ritual summon one machine ritual monster from your hand, or grave by tributing machine monster from your hand field whose total attack equal exceed that monster's. This deck still loses to fucking D Shifter. <laughs> ah! These three cards don't do a damn thing to a shifter. That's the funny thing. It's good support, don't get me wrong. The ritual is just even more OTK power. I don't feel like that was the issue with Drytron. This trap card just loses to Dimension Shifter. So yeah, th these new support cards don't change anything for Drytron. Now, I'm not even going to bullshit you. As I always say in these videos, I'm not going to put it in a bottle and breastfeed it to you. <laughs> um... I, I'm not no Drytron expert. These cards could absolutely change the game, but as far as I can tell, this shit loses to a D shifter, especially the trap card. And I don't really feel like a 5,000 attack monster, other than the, the fact it protects all of them from being destroyed by uh, card effects except itself. That's really good. Uh, and being level 12, that's not hard to get out. But like, I don't feel like the issue was OTKing with the deck, because if you're making the opponent skip their main phase, you're good. It's the fact that... Like, the deck can get nibbed and they lose to a shifter. Does this stop on... When your opponent activates a monster effect, you can banish Drytron Monster from your grave, original attack, negate the activate... Okay, so this can stop a nib. So if you establish this uh, before, like, on your fifth summon or before, then you can stop nib with this. And it's it's twice. So, like, they have to have nib plus imperm. That's interesting. Okay. Well, you shifter in the draw phase. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Let me know what you think.